Hi there, I'm Andrew. Welcome to Urban Rider for another look at some of the world's finest riding gear. Today we're going to be showing you the first of our new video reviews for the Bellstaff 2019 collection. It's a brand new collection from Bellstaff with some wonderful new additions as well as some revisions to the best sellers from previous years. What we have here is a great starting point. This is the Trailmaster Pro, the icon of the Bellstaff collection. This has been in their range since the brand was first born nearly 100 years ago. And although the silhouette of the Trailmaster has remained pretty true to the original throughout that duration, the technical spec and all the features and the safety has really come on leaps and bounds. For 2019, all new motorcycle garments released to the market are required to pass CE approval and Bellstaff have got that across the board as you would expect with all of their new collection. And this elevates it to a status that means it is certifiably protective. And there's always been debate about wax cotton garments as to whether they actually give you abrasion resistance or not. But the accreditation is here to prove the fact that these are safe garments in the event of a slide impact. But not only that, they look absolutely wonderful and the tailoring is as good as it's ever been from Bellstaff. So the Trailmaster Pro that we have here, the Pro is the bit that signifies this is the new one with that CE approval rating. The good point to start with is that the price hasn't gone up from previous collections and uh, there might have been a temptation to do that with the extra C approval added on and some other subtle features that have also been added to the jacket too. But really it remains very, very similar to the ones from previous seasons. So the overall look, feel, weight of the jacket hasn't changed. It has not become more bulky as a result of this passing of the CE approval. So it's very reassuring in that respect. We have three colors available in stock now. Here we have the black with a little brown offset stitching. We also have the brown as well as a separate colorway and an olive green too. All of them look wonderful, all available right now at urbanrider.co.uk. Before we go too far talking more about the jacket, let's just give it some perspective in terms of sizing. So I know a lot of you want to know that at this point, the sizing is a similar size to what we had before. So the large that we have here should fit a 41 and a 42 inch chest. I have just over a 41 inch chest and this is the size that I would go for if I had to choose one for myself. And so therefore the size guide is correct. Our size guide that is. Do bear in mind that here at Urban Rider, every jacket that comes in, we get every size out and we measure all the external measurements and post that on the website so that you can see and compare it to your favorite existing motorcycle jacket so you can see how it sizes up. And also if we feel the need, we change the size guide in terms of the recommended inch of chest that it fits because brands do get it wrong much more often than you think. But this one remains unchanged from last year. And as you can see, it fits me nicely. One little caveat is that I've always been able to fit into two sizes in Bellstaff jackets. Here I could take the large or the medium and it depends really if I wanted this as an all year jacket for both on and off the bike. I'd go for the large because I'd have a bit more room to wear it in the winter with extra layers. But if I was primarily using it around town and perhaps in nicer weather without the inner lining, I could definitely go with the medium and it would just be that little bit more fitted and perhaps a little bit more sort of fashion looking. So it's really over to you. If you've got questions, you can always email us. So the Trailmaster Pro, it takes over from the Taurus Trophy. That was the name given to the predecessor and for the last sort of 10 years or so. But I think Bellstaff basically realized everybody was searching online Bellstaff Trailmaster because that is the type of jacket that it is. So they've simply called it the Trailmaster and made things simple. But just to clarify, this carries on from the Taurus Trophy. There are other very similar items in the collection. There's the Trailmaster Pro 48, which actually came out a little bit earlier, just before the end of last year as a limited edition run, which is a slightly heavier version of this. And we also have the new Taurus Master Pro, which is, as the name suggests, slightly more technical, it's a bit more expensive, and it's just a little bit weightier for people that mainly have more of a touring focus but want this Trailmaster silhouette to the jacket. So check that out in one of our upcoming video reviews. But the Taurus Trophy, the Trailmaster, as it's now called, has really been an icon of the range. Since we started 11 years ago, this was at the forefront of our collection at Urban Rider, and it remains there right now. It's been one of the most copied jackets by other brands, but nobody can actually replicate the finesse of tailoring and finish that Bellstaff have achieved. And the feedback we get from customers really supports that this is a very popular jacket it's versatile in its application throughout the year but also in a number of different riding styles and tastes as well so we really do love this jacket it performs so well so in terms of the technical spec we'll give it a quick run through so for those of you who aren't as familiar with the jacket from previous collections this features a 10 ounce millerain wax cotton outer this is the premium wax cotton manufacturer here in the uk and bell staff have always used it it's wonderfully finished and because it's got the wax coating it's water resistant in and of itself 
itself. So what shouldn't happen is that the fabric should not saturate, so the water should simply run off and bead on the surface rather than soaking it and making it heavy. That makes it much more pleasant to wear and helps regulate body temperature as well as a few other things. But then backed up behind that outer 10 ounce wax cotton layer, you have a Myporex seam sealed waterproof and breathable membrane. This works incredibly well. We have never had anybody return a tourist trophy despite the many hundreds that we have sold over the years saying that the waterproofing liner doesn't do its job. It really does perform very, very well indeed. You also have a fully removable 150 gram thermal body liner, which is easily removable. It zips out from the inside and that extends all the way down the sleeves so that it gives you a really nice degree of warmth in winter, but take it out and it makes that jacket feel a little bit lighter and useful through, I would say most of the year, maybe not the really, really hot summer days because it's a wax cotton garment, it's not as breathable. You maybe then need to switch to something like a mesh jacket, but it's very functional, especially for here in the UK where we don't get too many of those days. And in terms of the protection that the armor gives you, you have the level one D3O stuff in the shoulders and elbows. This is removable. This is the go-to armor for most people in the industry. It's very hard to notice it, whether that's you're the person wearing it or if you're looking at someone wearing it because it's slimline, it's malleable, and it simply blends into the overall feel of the jacket under normal circumstances, but it locks together on impact, absorbing and dispersing any shock and preventing injury. Bellstaff claim that the 10 ounce wax cotton carried over from previous collections and variants of this jacket actually passes the abrasion resistant C approval requirements on its own, which was something that was a surprise to us, but they decided they didn't just want to pass the test, they wanted to exceed it further still, pass the necessary sort of minimum requirements, if you like. So they've incorporated Cordura panels, which is a very abrasion resistant nylon, into those zone one areas in the shoulders and in the elbows as well. So you also have extra layers of the wax cotton just on those panels on the shoulders and elbows, giving you a large degree of abrasion resistance where you would want it. And in terms of other details to the jacket, things like the branding is a really nice blend of having just a little bit to nod to the fact that you've got a bell staff jacket. So you have this black and gold embroidered patch just on the left sleeve and you also have it engraved into the very nice vintage snaps that you get with the spring loaded mechanisms, making them easy to operate on the collars and in the zipper down the middle as well and on the overlay pocket flaps. The cuffs and collars themselves have adjustable increments and you get the roll bar system for this neck piece. The inside is lined with a corduroy to make it soft and comfortable so you can do it up nice and tight. So if you do want to prevent any cold air coming in on those chilly days, you can get it done nice and tight, forming a secure seal without compromising on comfort. You've got the roll bar system on the waist belt. People often wear that around the back as well if you want to have it out of the way just to give it a slightly different look. So that's one option for you. And you have this embroidered patch, which is a rollover piece that goes over that bar, protecting your tank from scratching from the buckle system. The two lower snaps are also rubberized as well just to prevent it there. And you can see you've got these precursor sleeves for an ergonomic fit too. So taking a look inside the garment, underneath this central overlay flap you can see is the central zipper with this lovely roll bar system with the bell staff branding, again just engraved into it. And that double flap overlay really does prevent any unwanted water or air from getting through. You'll notice the zipper's a bit shorter if you were familiar with last year's one. You used to have a double two-way zipper which was necessary because the zip extended all the way to the bottom and that meant that if you were needing to splay your legs out a bit more then often it would get caught so you, the two-way zipper allowed you to do it up so you may see that as a sort of step backwards only having this one-way zipper but because it's higher up you don't need it so there, it simply negates the need to have a two-way zipper and the zip works really well as you would expect and on the inside you've got this 150 gram quilted thermal liner that I mentioned and you can just see poking behind that you've got the lovely blue and grey check tartan bell staff lining which runs throughout the underside of the jacket and the zip simply runs around the perimeter there so as I said very very easy to remove that and you've also got one vertically accessed YKK chest pocket which sits underneath all those waterproof layers so it's a great place to store valuables like your phone it's simply not going to get wet. So a true icon and revised and improved and certified for 2019. So what's not to like? But if you have any questions, any thoughts or any feedback, do let us know in the section below and we'll be very happy to get back to you and stay tuned for more video reviews of the world's finest running gear. And as I said, specifically this fantastic new collection from Bellstaff. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you again soon. Goodbye.